today we're going to be testing and wearing specifically designed to be comfortable enough to sleep in jeans. I can sleep in these? They're that comfortable? I have a lot of questions going through my head, so that is what we're going to be testing today. So I found these jeans on Bustle. Bustle is like a really trendy website where they just put like a lot of trends, like new things that are happening and just like new products like these jeans. This is what I read. Diesel jog jeans are specifically designed to be comfortable enough to sleep in. And then I saw the picture, I'm like, those actually look really, really cute. And then I saw the price range of these diesel jeans, and they range from $248 to $348. <laughs> it just like makes my heart drop. These better be the most mind-blowing jeans on the planet. So let's hop onto the website and pick out uh, some of these jeans, but I'm not gonna be buying them off of the website because I do have like a local diesel store. So I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna like, you know, try some on because I'm not really sure how these jeans are gonna fit me. Fit me concealer, <laughs> no. Okay, this is jeans. <laughs> Don't get distracted, Vienna. So we're on the diesel website right now. I'm in the little women's department. So let's scroll around and look for the little sleeping picture. Like, oh, here we have some. Woo! Oh, these are so cute. Oh my gosh. We have Faza jog jeans. These look really cute. I do like how they're easy to spot on the website because they have like a sleeping picture. Isn't that kind of cute actually? Very cute. Anywho, um, these look, mm, those aren't really my style. I'm definitely finding that they're all very baggy. Like they're not really like tight fitting jeans, which that would make sense because I don't feel like tight fitting jeans are very comfortable. I really am liking these, but they definitely look like joggers, not really jeans. Like as you can see right up here, these are cute. Ooh. So I kind of went for like a diverse three. For number one, we have a medium kind of distressed wash. Then we have like a gray jogger jean. And then we have like a really light wash. So I feel like we have three different options, like a solid three. So let's go to the store and confirm the one that we're gonna wear all day and sleep in. So we're heading into diesel now. I'm really actually really excited, but a little nervous. Uh, I look like a tourist. I'm like, let me take pictures of your jeans. Um, no, but let's do this. I have to find the women's section. So he's grabbing the original FaZa jog jeans right now. Hopefully they have them. He says sometimes they don't. Um, but we will see. He's grabbing the smallest size. And then I have a few more for him to grab. But yes. Oh, how interesting. Look at this. They have like, like a jogger kind of material inside. It's not like plush, but it's nice. Kind of really comfy. I could see these being sleepable. So he just put me in a dressing room. Um, these are really, really, really cute actually. Hopefully they fit though. They look a little bit, but I do feel like they look kind of big on the models. I think that's kind of like the style, which I like baggy jeans. Like that's kind of what I'm wearing now. Um, but he actually asked me what I'm filming for. I don't know if I have it on camera. Um, I said YouTube and he was like, oh, and I was like kind of awkward. Shh. Um, but it's okay. Let's try on the first original phases. I'm putting them on right now. Ooh, interesting. They're really cute actually. I really like the style of them because they're kind of like almost, they're definitely low rise, but like if you wear them high rise, they look a little funny, but still, they're really cute. I actually really like the style. I just took them off. Look at that, that's interesting. So they like have like these little like white patches over the rips, but like there wasn't really a big apparent rips, but that's really odd and interesting at the same time. But next we have these jeans right here. I forget how they pronounce it, Kaya. But they're definitely more of like the sweatpant band up here. I think they just look like kind of odd sweatpants. Um, but they still are comfortable. Like the material is very, very soft. Then we have the Faza C jeans. So the first one I tried on was the Keza style, and the last one slash this one, the third one, is the Keza C style. I really do like these. The color is really cool, and the patching design, I like the bottom of the leg is also really unique. I like these. Oh no, uh oh. <laughs> no, but I really do. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. I'm still deciding, I'm gonna call my mom in. So I called my mom in, I'm trying to decide which one from these two right here. Uh, me and my mom were both thinking number one. I'm definitely most impressed with that, so number one it is. Yeah, these ones. Have you ever tried the jog jeans? Yes. Do you like them? Of course you do. That's the word here, but you know what I mean. Well, I mean, like, they're just really comfortable. They are. 380. Oh, that's crazy. Awesome. Thank you so much. Right? Exactly. Good luck. I like that. <laughs> so, I got the deep. 
Crow is not happy. He wants some jeans too. Anywho, uh, I'm really, really excited. We're gonna wear these tomorrow and just experience the $380. The next day. It's the next day and we have the diesel jeans and the nice bag. Oh my God. Oh. Oh, what is this? Here we have them. Oh my gosh. It's time to put them on. I have them on. They do feel really nice. I'll have to say, of course, I tried them on in the dressing room, but they do feel very comfy. But then again, they kind of feel like a normal jean, but just like a little bit more comfy because of the inner material. Because I have like that really light, almost like a towel-y, like a soft towel material inside. Here's a kind of 360 on the jeans. They're definitely lower in the crotch. But I'll have to say, I do think they're pretty like high fashion and cute. What I do do is I kind of, I do do. <laughs> I just kind of pull these up so they like stay up a little bit. Because if they're just like kind of hanging out, they kind of just like, I don't know, they don't look as cute. They look very trendy. Like these jeans, that's how I would describe them. Like European trendy, if that makes any sense. So very put together, which I like. So now that I have the outfit on, my mom and my dad are gonna be reacting to the outfit. My mom didn't see them on, my dad didn't see them on, and my dad also doesn't know the price. So yeah, he's gonna be reacting to that. Also, I feel like I am gonna get a lot of hate because these were, you know, $380. My mom did not buy this for me, my dad did not buy this for me, no one bought this for me besides myself. I bought this for myself. I'm an actress and a YouTuber, so I do make my own money, and I put it all back into my YouTube channel, so, you know, without the jeans, I couldn't be making this video. But, anywho, so, moving on to my parents' reaction. Here's my dad! I don't know. They're kind of baggy. <laughs> well, you like baggy, you crazy! I know, but I just don't know if I... I, I was expecting them to be more nicer looking. They, what? They look like rags. Uh, what? <laughs> so, now, how much do you think they are? Uh, I bet you they were at least 100? Uh-uh. More? Uh-huh. 200? Uh-uh. 250? Uh-uh. 300? More? Four? No way, oh, I'm out of here. $20 less than 400. Uh, 375? 380. Oh, that's nuts. <laughs> that was the Gosh, okay, my mom. <laughs> what? You guys, your reaction. I mean, they look good on you. I'm just, you know, usually, yeah, I don't know. So my dad is like, oh, oh. And my mom's like, huh, huh. So I just took the jeans off because I kept on feeling something like itching, like right here. I was like, ah, what is that? So I take off the jeans and I realize that there's these odd little like slits right here. So this is like rubbing against like the back part of my knee and making me feel like there's like a little spider or something. Um, but I can tell that they were supposed to be here because it kind of makes like the jeans a little more scrunchy when you put them on. Kind of ishy. But um, anywho, I'm gonna put these back on. But now it's time to do my day. The best food ever. I make it my food because I eat it so often. Boba! Why is this so good? One boba later. And a 25 minute car ride to Bed Bath & Beyond. Let's see if these jeans wrinkle. My thought is they don't. My mom is putting this out like it's really puffy. Like right here, like it's like, I'm trying to show you. <laughs> okay, enough of that. Blech, I wish they didn't design it like that. But let's see if there's wrinkles. I don't think they're wrinkled actually. So I think they're good. Well, hello there. <laughs> Uh, Fiona, um, we are going around, going around, we're going around. Interesting fact, I cannot, oh, I cannot spin in circles very well. I feel like I'm gonna barf actually. That's really bad. We're shopping for affordable pillows with my really expensive pants. I'll have to say, I do feel really like, kind of special. Like I feel like I earned these pants. But like then again, <laughs> they're really expensive. Like I could rent a hotel, like a really, really nice hotel with the money that I paid for these jeans. What the heck though? These are the coolest pants ever. Besides the ones I'm wearing, these are only $19.99. Yes, everything feels so cheap compared to these pants. Slowly, or should I say despacito, <laughs> I feel like Justin Bieber kind of in these pants. Like, what's up, bruh? Oh my god, so cool. Well, hello there. <laughs> I just love these jeans. I think they're so fun. Okay, enough. What I don't need, but really want. <laughs> I definitely have to say, I'm definitely pulling up my pants a little more than I usually would because they are baggy, but it's kind of annoying, but still, it's pretty cute, so it's kind of worth it, but then again, 
I don't know. Gotta go. With my jeans. The bathroom went well. Oh, the bathroom went well. <laughs> oh no, but it was it was all good. Yellow. Uh -huh. Yellow. Oh no. Yellow. Uh, we're getting boom checkup and a notebook. Ooh, yes, it looks good with my jeans too. I after Boba, Bed Bath & Beyond, Target, my jeans are definitely getting a lot more comfortable. I think because they're like stretching out more, kind of rubbing against my skin so it almost smooths down like the little like weird like little edge things. I don't know, that's kind of odd. Um, but they do feel really nice. It may be just because I'm doing other things and not just thinking about my jeans. <laughs> not my beautiful jeans. Um, but yeah, they definitely are feeling much nicer. A dollar? <laughs> the dollar store. Berry banana nectar for a dollar? A dollar? A dollar! It is so awkward doing it in the store because people stare at you like, what is wrong with her? I also got a balloon at the dollar store. How cute is it? It just makes you happy. But normally I get into my comfy umfies, that's what I call it. Slash sweatpants and like a t-shirt that I don't really care about. So uh, I'm gonna be wearing these jeans though, so I'm not gonna change out of them. Okay, so I just put on my top and I feel like my outfit is like comfy cute. Like it's actually really cute. I literally just have my pajama shirt on with like jeans and I feel like they look really cute but they're jog jeans, so you know, <laughs> cool jeans. <laughs> but like, to be honest, I totally just wear this out. I think these jeans just make everything look trendier. You're probably gonna laugh at me so hardcore, but I love doing this. Yeah, I can do it still. It's just like they're a little tight, but then again, the crotch is pretty wide, so I have flex room. Hopefully I'm not stretching them out though. I'd give it like a B plus for working out. Mm. But I'll definitely have to say throughout the day, I've said crotch a lot more because they've been stretching out a lot there. It was probably from that like froggy, like a flying frog pose. I don't even know what it's called. Um, but I'm getting ready for bed. I definitely have never gone to bed with jeans. Like that just doesn't sound right. But these were designed to be comfortable enough to sleep in. I definitely say they, they feel okay. I'm comfortable, but I also am really tired, so that could be it too. Wow, I'm pretty surprised. These are comfy, but like, you know, I've been wearing these for pretty much like 24 hours. But all I want right now is just some loose, soft pajamas. Oh, this feels so good. These will definitely not replace my amazing pajama pants. But these would be like perfect for the airport or for school where you know you're gonna be waking up kinda early and you're just really lazy and you just kinda wanna roll out of bed and boom, you got an outfit. But you know, brush your hair and put some shoes on. But yeah, you know what I mean? So was this false advertisement? Mm, I'd say a little. They definitely stretched it like a lot. Like, every jean is just about comfortable enough to sleep in if you're really tired. <laughs> but they are comfortable jeans. They make everything kind of just look effortlessly trendy. They're comfortable, and they made my pajamas look cute. So, the only downside is really the price tag. So you have to make up your own mind, but I am so excited now that I have them. So thank you so much for watching, and huggy huggy!